All right, rock and roll, rock and roll. Let's get it kicked off right. If you ever see a schizzle man bounding around at night, you can guarantee that he's trying not to lose his only life. And if he just happens to want to venture to a dangerous land, you can bet your butt that he's going with an iron sword in hand. If you ever see a schizzle man wandering around the woods, you can guarantee that he's out there making chat feel good. And if he just wants to risk his life on the way to 200 more, there's just no stopping him after all. This is Skiz Hardcourt. Skiz Hardcourt. Skiz Hardcourt. It's a man on a mission. He don't need permission to make it to 200 or more. On Skiz Hardcourt. All right, all right. That's what I'm talking about. Hey, so I have so much stuff on my desk right now. Like, I need to, I need to get my, I need to sort myself out. Yeah, for example, ready? I'm going to reach for something here. You guess what I'm reaching for. No, it's not poker chips. Ready? Yeah. Back scratch up. Uh. Right? Oh, what am I reaching for now? Yeah. How about a little like Cardinal, Arizona Cardinals fidget popper? Okay, what, what am I reading for now? What am I reaching for? How about some gum? How about my Harry Potter one? How about a bag of dog treats? My dogs don't even come upstairs. This was in my pocket after one of my morning walks with Kevin Bubbles Malone, refrigerator Jimmy Matadugan, and I never took it out of my pocket until I took it out of my pocket and I put it on the desk. No Oreos here. You know what? If there were Oreos here, I would snack on them all day. And then I, I would look like I'm supposed to be floating up in the air in the Macy's parade. And then also I would feel very sick because sugar does not make me feel super dupe. <laughs> It does. Kitty Mama with that restuff. Thanks so much. That's 16 months. Look what day we're on, people. We're on day three, a five, a nine, a half, a bad. We're on day 359 in hardcore. Okay. Now, if you were, look at this, another, another stream while I cook dinner. Perfect timing. I love it. I love it. Let's not make you, uh, let's not make you burn anything. Um, all right. So, here we are, day 359. It's Braveheart. Is it Braveheart? Braveheart is not on my desk. Now, if you remember, we were... Hey! We want to go outside. Up! We want to go further north, and... Uh, so, it's not that Imp's got stuff going on. It's that, you know, the... Um, without spoilers, we wrapped up the Naked and Scared recordings, and so now the videos are just being released. But yeah, he's got some stuff going. Well, let me put it this way. He had stuff going on. And I'm supposed to have stuff going on. <laughs> Both of us are. If you know what I'm talking about. But, you know, as I'm going to be out of this season. Because uh, I'm going to be traveling. All right, so let's do this. Let's pack up. Let's go north. Look at all this nonsense I'm carrying. It's embarrassing. I'm embarrassed. Let's see what we can do here. Let's consolidate here. We're going to go north again. What are those? What are those? Uh, you know what I mean? What was? What are the coordinates? It's like 888. No, I know. I wrote it down over here. I wrote it down over here. No, I didn't. Yeah, I did. 888, negative 6100. Okay, so that's where the deep dark is going to be. We're in hardcore. We want to find a deep dark so we can make a plan on how to get a warden out of there. We'll capture him when we see a dupe. Um, but let's keep in mind we gotta we gotta go we gotta go quite a ways. Not not too bad, but we gotta go horse north. We gotta go this way. And we gotta go eight eight what eight, eight, eight Yeah. Yeah we go. We gotta go that way, like almost a thousand blocks, and we gotta go that way. Alright, that's what we're gonna do. It's eleven. Eleven PM, you're so tired, dude. I'm getting really tired at night. And here's why, because I wake up at like 5.30 or 6 a.m. and I walk Kevin Bubbles Malone refrigerated Jimmy Matt I do again for two miles. And then what I do is I work all day 
and then and then I stream, which is my, my favorite part. But I'm always pretty tired after the streams. Let me get rid of this garbage here. We got to get rid of this garbage, people. Okay, there's so much stuff here I don't need. We'll keep the diamonds because that's what I'm going to do. Uh, and we need the bed. Get in my pocket, Mr. Bed. I'm going to take you guys too so we can just start cooking right away when we get there. Oh, we never need this guy here because we're going to need an anvil. Or I mean a, a, a name tag. Because we're going to name them. And we're going to take this. And we're going to take the wood. <laughs> It just keeps on going. Uh, I got my arrows and I have my trusty bow. Oh, I'm going to take this. Oh, that's why we had the anvil. Because we get to 33 levels of XP. We can repair our amazing bow new. It's a fluff fluff with the 110 bits there. Thank you very much. It says, the skis retirement fund. And uh, then Derbs with the 200 bits. I'll be lurking for the first bit so I can get ready for work. But I'll tune back in soon. All right, Derbs. You be good. Okay. And then you work in two hours, does a loo. Are you guys ready? I'm not stalling. I know you think I am. I'm not. I'm gonna grab a bite. Okay. Stop it. Uh, leather boots. I don't think I need the shears. Mm, I got food. Lo oh, man. Look at that. See what I almost left behind? Okay. Up, up. All right, we're going now. Driver. I have no chests on me. <laughs> I'm taking this. Uh, here we go. I'm not stalling. Stop telling me I'm stalling. I'm not. Okay, we're going north now. Remember, we started to dig down. That was the other place. All right, here we go. For real. Okay. I want to do this. Remember, we're going to go this way. Okay, so, so pause. Wait, what? We got to go 888, negative 6,100. So let's do this. All right. Good job, Donna Bits. I think very much lurking and listening while I change the starter in my car. Be entertaining, boss. So I'll tell you, I have not worked. I used to work on my car all the time. Starters are no joke either. Starters are no joke because you have this like tension belt that is impossible to move. But you got, unless you know what you're doing, right? There's a thing in there. You got a big old, put a wrench on there and crank it back. Give yourself some slack in that, that belt. But when you first try working on that stuff and you don't know what you're doing, it's humbling. <laughs> it is humbling. And okay. Negative 6,100, right? 88, 88, negative 6,100 is where I think I need to go. And this should be a deep dark. Right. Daddy bones with the 200 bits. That says just because you're amazing. Thank you. All right. Look, 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 look. This will be good. Give me a nice open field to, oh, that's, is this look, this is the exact, that's the opposite of a nice open field. But look, this is going to be, wow. Wow. Okay. So this just happened. Poopy! Let me get this stuff here. This sucks. <laughs> this really sucks. Um. All right, so well, we gotta go this way a little bit. Okay, we're gonna go this way. Just let's go to 888-6100 and turn. So this this is silliness. Look how this is ridiculous. So what this means is that I'm gonna need to go. I'm probably gonna go down there and just dig in this direction so right so let's 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 carve out this area and we'll we'll dig right around here and we'll start to dive we're at 126 that is gonna be one heck of a descent but we got a lot of good resources around us everybody so let's do this wait i got no space to pick stuff up i gotta okay here we go let me let me just dump my junk we gotta create a little starter base here we know how this works it's our third one okay that's how we know how it works and in fact Grab this. This will be where we'll start to go underground and back over here. We got to go low. Yes, definitely. Do what am I thinking? We're definitely starting back here because we have to go such a great distance. What am I supposed to do about this water? You guys said that the, that they'll walk on water is what you told me. You promised. Anyways, I I, I haven't tested that, so I'm hoping that's true. You see a fire? That was lava. Get out of here, Mr. Lava. 
All right. So I, this is what I'm thinking, dude. This will be our little starter base right here in the water. And this is where we'll start to dig down over there. So is that... Okay, more lava? What, what is going on? Hi! Hey! Scared me. Hi! Hey! Ooh! Ooh! I didn't, I didn't enjoy that. I didn't enjoy that at one bit. Let me get this tree out of the way. Like I said, this will be our starter base. And we'll dig that direction in a diagonal. And hopefully we won't be dealing with any water. But I think this is going to, this was supposed to be a deep dark. I think it's going to be an ancient city. Because you guys had said yesterday, big tall mountains are indicative of that. That there's an ancient city underneath, you know. You missed the Monday stream, new world or continue. So Orca, what we're doing here, this is still a continuation of 118 hardcore and we are on day something 360 now. Um, but I, I did convert it to 119. So we are, we are, we're, we're, we're trying to go for, uh, you know what I mean? We're going to go for a, we're going to go for a deep dark. We're going to try to get a warden in ultra hardcore. And if I can get him all the way back home, that's, probably not going to happen today but if we can at least get a temporary trap on him then that'll be oh that'll be glorious that'll be glorious cat with that host thank you very much welcome raiders no big deal just in hardcore and we're about to start hunting a warden you know so my dude i feel like uh i feel like who, who's the guy in the original jaws who they really kind of you know go to he's the go-to guy to hunt sharks <laughs> That's that's how I should be talking. You guys know what I'm talking about. You came over there, and he bites you, and you're kicking and screaming. That guy's that guy's one of the awesomest characters of all time. <laughs> Quint, that's right. Lolo Cry got it. Qu Quint. Oh, such a good movie. Morse code, gifting out those five subs. You're awesome. Thank you for that. Let's get this buddy bombs going for Morse code. And then let's break out the shovel and let's do a little bit of it. If I, the problem is, I don't want to build out of dirt because Endermen are jerk faces and all of their jerkiness. Don't you know? But we might do it anyways. I want to just get this going. I want to build it so I can move on with my life. Not too much to ask. In fact, no, no, no. Here's what we're going to do, people. Okay? Watch what we're going to do. Where's my, where's the chest? Where is, it's right there in front of your face there, Skiz. Okay, let's just do some of this. Empty, 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 empty. Just do it. Now, let's get this good stuff here because we're going to start digging that way anyways. In fact, I should just start right now. That's what I should do. Start digging, take the cobblestone, build something, and then we'll sleep when it starts to get dark. It's amazing. It's like I've played Minecraft before. Master Big Daddy, that resub, you're amazing. That's five months. Hey, Skiz, is Impulse really building a studio because it's taking like two years? Uh, yeah, well, he's building a guest house, um, but in, in that guest house is going to be, uh, okay, good water. Oh yes. There's just a couple drops here. Poopy. Uh, so he's building, so we're going to go from a different direction here. Um, he's building a guest house, but uh, that's where he's going to move his office. That's where his studio is going to be. Uh, it's taking forever. Believe me, he's not dragging his feet, but the world we live in contract work is very, very difficult. There's a huge delay on everything. And I know this because my uncle builds pools. And um, yeah, built, even building a pool, something, I wouldn't say something as simple as that, but something that we we as people have been doing for a long time is is a heck of a challenge now. Okay, I got, let me get rid of this lava. It's making me nervous. And then hop, 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 hop. And... Uh, hop, uh, hop, hop, and did you hop down there? Hop, here we go, and hop. I said hop. Hop! What's happening? It's like magic lava. Okay, so I want to get rid of that. Now, here's the deal. How do I get around this? is ridiculous. I don't want to have to deal with it like this I gotta figure out what's the best way to get underground underneath all this water mm, I'm thinking probably on the other side to be honest I think it's gonna be to just start over there all right that's where we're at 
Okay, so that means, dude, what we're gonna do, dude, is we're gonna start right here. How my bad is. This is gonna be where we're start gonna, gonna start to go down. We're gonna take this cobblestone. We're gonna build our, our little place. Okay, that's what we're gonna do. Oh, it feels good to get back at this, man. Yesterday we lost so much time because I was like, we just, I couldn't get the deep dark. And then we built two separate like little starter houses. <laughs> it's just so stupid. <laughs> Maybe feel stupid. Morse code, what are you doing? Gifting out another five subs. We need those butter bombs rocking and rolling from Morse code. Unbelievable Morse code. Thank you very much. It's 92 degrees in Wisconsin today in June. Okay, what? how hot is it here in Arizona? I'll tell you, since I have to get up at 6 a.m. to walk Kevin Bubbles Malone refrigerator Jimmy Madidugan, that's a testament that it gets warm very fast. And in fact, yeah, it's 103 right now. So so it's 103 right now. And this office I, is like all like surface walls, outside surface walls. All right, the whole thing is. Morse code, thank you so much for that, man. Uh, and so that means it gets super, super hot, right? So I bought myself a little mobile cooler, but then I was running late and I'm like, you know, I didn't run it. So I run my regular AC at like 73 degrees. <laughs> it's my, my electric bill is going to be like $600, but you know, that's, that's just where we're at. When I'm going to, you can't, I'm going to cry about it. What are you going to do? Cry about it. All right, here we go. And I should also show you guys, I'll show you guys a little, you know what? I almost want to show you now. We'll take a little break. Sometimes we like to take little breaks. Here's the two little breaks. Okay. Here's the two little breaks that we should do today. One is we should, we should bring up, we was going to do this yesterday and I blew it. One is we should bring up that clip of the betrayal I did to Scar <laughs> in the last Among Us because it was delicious. And then the other one is I got to show you like my, my son sent me a video of uh, him in the gym today doing something. It's not, it's not, this is actually not a weightlifting video. It's something else that is so cool. I think I might find a way to show you. I'm gonna have to hold up my phone like this, but it could, it does potential to be cool. Shadow Thief with the $5. <laughs> Thank you, Shadow Thief. Are wardens good for something more than prompting me to run the other way? Why, why are we catching one? Ready? I have an answer for you and let this be, this should be an, this is the answer that I apply to lots of things in life. Are you ready? You're asking me, why are we doing this? I bet you, a lot of you know the answer. I'm going to take a sip, uh, a preemptive, a victory sip. And when I'm done sipping, I bet one of you has got the answer in chat. Ready? Billow Poppy's close because why not? <laughs> That's why. Why not? Because catching one is very hard and very stupid. So rock and roll. Boogie. Well, that tier one, you're amazing. Thank you very much. What is what is that cat? What is that emote there? Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six. That should be more than enough. We'll do stairs. Yeah, this is what I'm talking about. Yep, 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 yep. Bum, 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 bum. Skiz the Warden Whisperer. I got a plan for my uh, 119 solo skis world, to tell you that. And you'll be happy to know, in that world at least, I just built the little creeper farm. <laughs> I can't stand it. I, well, I'm gonna, in the next episode, I'm working on getting back to my old home in solo skis. And uh, that's a heck of a travel. So I need rockets to just never be a problem. That's what has to happen. It's either Becca Sue or, oh, because. It's gotta be because. Be because makes more sense than Becca Sue, given the context of our conversation. <laughs> Uh, it looks like Becca Sue. <laughs> All right, here we go. 
Now we're going in the right direction. In fact, 888, dude. And yeah, yeah oh, we're in a good spot here. We're going to hit that deep dark. And if it's an ancient city, then maybe we can get a name tag. I need lots of wool, dude. I don't want to die right away, though. This is okay. Skiz, you're in a hardcore world. Can you please remember that? Like, I have to say it out loud. Otherwise, I'd, I'd play dumb. And you guys are like, eh, that's a pre existing condition. Bum, 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 bum. All right, hands up if you saw Impulse's video today. Hands up if you saw his Hermitcraft video today. For realsies. Yeah, Poppy, I'm in hard, I'm in hardcore. Yeah, dude. So, um, you've seen what he's building. Goodness, friggin' gracious. I am so, I am so proud of his building skills lately. He is, you know why? Because he's pushing it, man. He's getting uncomfortable. You know what I mean? He's not just going with what's comfortable. He's getting uncomfortable, and the result is just some really cool stuff man it's amazing and i haven't even finished the episode yet i'm like halfway through it you know and here's what i've learned about this i don't like to put on episodes on the side like or in anything when i watch tv when i watch tv show i don't even like movies with subtitles i don't want to read when i'm watching a movie you know what i want to do when i'm watching a movie i want to watch the movie that's what i want to do homie so when i put on an impulse episode i sit there like this and I watch it like that. I'm not riveting. Uh oh. This just opened up. All right, we might have a problem here. News 10. Uh oh. What is happening? I didn't like that. I didn't like that even a little bit. Let's put a little torchy torch down there. All right. You have to use subtitles. Can't stay focused. You have to see. My family's like that. They love the subtitles on. And I'm like, turn them off. I hate it. I think my logic is, is sound. When I watch a movie, I like the activity of watching the movie, so I prefer to watch the movie. Okay, what do we got over here? Anything I need to worry about? Any, anybody over here interested in being a jerk? What am I dealing with? Take it easy. All right, give me this iron, dude. Let me buy that top. Cheers. Cheers. All right. Uh, boop and boop. And check this out. Oh, and it's and now here. If you're new to skis, and it's possible, it's possible you some of you Che and I'm booping over here. And it's okay that I'm booping. Okay. And I need the true skis fans to toss out the emote. Why is it okay that I'm booping? Because everybody boops. Bill and Poppy knew where I was going with that. Like before I started. Everybody boops. Boop, boop, boop. Boop, 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 boop. Yuggity, 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 yuck. Up. Oh, I could have sweeped myself. Look at all those everybody boops emotes. <laughs> everybody hops too. Well, no, everybody boops. Only skiz hops. Some people hop. Okay, if I could get the rest of my XP to repair my uh, bow, well, that 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 would be super dupe pooper scoop. Speaking of pooper scoop, so Kevin Bubbles Malone, refrigerator Jimmy Matt, I do again, destroyed the cat pooper scooper. Oh yeah, I'm not making that up. He destroyed it. So I got a new one. And then on top of that, we had to get a new pooper scooper for the dogs. My wife went and got one that is, I mean, I guess if we ever own a Tyrannosaurus Rex in the future, it's the right one. But this thing looks like it's literally designed to move gravel. All right, hopefully we can take a nap here. May have waited too long. Up, 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 up. up. Hurry up! <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. All right. Time to go back down. 
Uh, actually, it's time to empty our pockets. Actually, it's not. It's time to do this. Where this is, you know, because sometimes you just gotta. Sometimes in life you gotta be awesome. So let's be awesome. And how we're gonna do that? We're gonna build right here. This is our gig. Man, I want Swift Snake. Okay, like I said, nothing too fancy. In fact, that'll be the center. Whew, good one. one, two, three. One, two, three. This is like, all right, that's, that's fine. It's not the center. I'll be fine. Shadow Thief with $5. <laughs> yeah, you. Look at that. Thank you, Shadow Thief. Challenge. Watch Train Spotting without subtitles. Then watch it again with subtitles and go, oh, that's what they're saying. <laughs> yeah. All right, fair enough. All right. And that, and that example there, Train Spotting, is those accents are like, I think that's that that might be um McGregor's like first real breakout film ever, right? Old school you McGregor right there. All right. There are times I'll watch subtitles. I'm like, ah. Oh. Sometimes I'll put them on like just for a second so I can be like, what do they just say? I don't understand. But for the most part, in fact, you know what I should watch? You know what I want to do? Oh my gosh. Here's what I want to watch one time with subtitles. Are you ready? You ready? Snatch. Listen to Brad Pitt do that pikey accent. Oh man. I love that movie and I understand maybe 12% of what Brad Pitt's saying, but I love it. That dude is such a stud. There, I said it. You want to dig? See, Fluffaluff and I are the same. I don't like subtitles and your entire family has them on. They always want them on. I'm like, turn it off. I just want to watch the movie. I don't want to read. I already went to school. Oops. I mean, do that. Let's try to do it again. All right, now this is our third little house here. Just to get ourselves a little safe zone. And boop, 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 boop. Gosh darn it. Boop, 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 boop. All right, forget it. And nooch. Okay. Probably use a torch in here. I mean, where's my coal? I just guess the center. That thing's off center, Nooch. There we go. We'll do we'll do a double door. That's the boss thing to do. Alright, give me these torches. Let's light this gig up. And just so we feel good. Alright, here we go. And do I have a crafting table? No. <laughs> what would I? What are we talking about Dumbledore for? I tell you. In my opinion, the first Dumbledore in the first two movies, played by Richard Harris, was so amazing that when he passed, God rest him, I was really worried. And I and I think the second Dumbledore did all right, and it, and I and I I think it was a direction thing, but he was too frantic. He was too frantic for my taste. He was still good, you know what I mean. But the Richard Harris version of Dumbledore was exactly like what I envisioned when I would watch the movies and stuff. You know what I'm saying? Like that's what I envisioned, dude. Was that set? Was the first? Was the Richard Harris Dumbledore? He was the Dumbledore of all Dumbledores. This. Remember, as soon as we uh, get 33 XP, we got to fix our bow. You got to remind me, people. It's going to happen. What's up, everybody? We played your music. In fact, you know what we should do, dude? Let's wait like another five or ten minutes, another another uh, Cinco or Diaz, and then let's play that song again. Might as well do that. Well, where, where, where'd it go? I just had it, and here you go. Actually, no. We're not going to do that. We might, you know, we're, we're going to do all this. We'll leave that there for now. Uh, leather boots. Oh, 
Okay. I don't have any doors on. It's very risky. There's my crafting table. There's my doors. All right. This is my. This is the first. You guys, this is the first crafting table I've made in this world. I mean, come on. That's kind of cool. Right? Look at this. We're on day. Uh, we're on. We're on day three sixty-two. That's the first crafting table I've made in this hardcore world. I mean, that's impressive. That's impressive stuff. Okay, there we go. Why why three doors? Why? Why does it always make you three doors? Maxima skipped in the sub over to Eloise. Thank you very much for that, Maximus. Um okay. We're moving on now. I am gonna bring this. My gut is telling me to do that. I'm leaving this, I'm leaving this, I'm leaving this, I'm leaving this, taking the honey, taking the shield. All right, it's time to keep on keeping on. We're going to keep working now. Got to keep an eye on our tools, though, people. Oh, torches. I got 43 torches. And some wood, and I can make some more, and I'll do it right now. Nooch. Look at that. Woo! All right. Now we continue. What are you saying, bro? No, it's not. when you're explaining where a chip shop is to a drunk Scotsman and all you get back is eh? <laughs> I don't get it. Oh, the wool. We'll have to come back and look for sheep later. That's what's going to have to happen there. Like I said, I just want to find the deep dark. Let's get, let's just get some promise here. You know what I'm saying? Bond. Jopra Bond. Well, that 31 months Jopra Bond. Amazing. It says, holy cow. That is a long time Bond, Jopra Bond. I can't say your name unless I say both. Ever since that little sample, that little sound sample. All right, nooch, 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 and snoogans. All right, we got it. Let's up. Nope. We should be actually. What level are we at? Yeah, we gotta wait. Well, seven's not bad. We're on level seven right now. That means we're moving in the right direction. Boy, this pick has seen better days. You have foods, lots of burgers. I do. I do. Lots of steak. It's almost like I'm like, I'm almost boring now. I'm so prepared. And we're going to come back and put stairs in here. Oh. Okay. There we go. Is there space in Impulse SV Studio for two drum kits for a drum off? No, I wouldn't say that. Probably not for two full drum sets. I mean, maybe there might be. I don't know if we do a drum off. I think our competitive drumming days are behind us. But we, I'm sure we're going to have one of our podcasts. We'll, we'll probably bust out the pads and show you some of that marching style stuff. That could be fun. Okay. Um... Okay, so this is happening now. This is, we are really shallow to be getting skulk sensors already. Don't you think? I feel like we're really shallow for skulk sensors. Derps with 100 bits there. It's a good thing skulk sensors can't hear your Twitch notifications. Uh, that's a good point. Oh my gosh, there's lots. Of, okay, hold on. They're going, wait, hold on. I need to see this. Let's see the direction. Can't tell which way it's going. I think it's going that way. Oh, look at this. We have Skulk. Our first Skulk of Hardcore Skis Nooch. I don't know if I want to go. I got a thing. Boop, 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 boop. Friendly asteroid of that reshub. Five great months with the skids. You're amazing. Thank you. 
Okay, I really wish I had a, a proper pick, or, um, not pick. Um, not pick. A uh, hoe, I need a good hoe. Okay, here we are. This is, I turned the music down because I kind of need to, I'm nervous. Hop, 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 hop. 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 Okay. Let me just do this for my own peace of mind real quick. Look at this opening. Look at this place, dude. I don't want to deal with this nonsense. All right, here's what I'm going to do. We're going to close this up. Because I don't need to worry about that stupid stuff. Okay, does this go anywhere? Ooh. Ooh. Hop. <gasps> okay, those are... Oh. Um... That's the ancient city, dude. That's the ancient city right there. Holy moly. Okay. Tell this skulk sensor to shut up. That's it. Okay, so that's the ancient city. If I fall, I'm um that would be bad news. Oh my gosh, there's shriekers everywhere. Why am I doing this? <laughs> okay. Oh, there's a chest right there, dude. Okay. <sighs> Poopy. No, I don't want to I don't want to do it anymore. Well, how's it why is it gotta be so low like that? All right, hold on. Let me go back to my Okay, hold on. Let me get let me get sorted here. Hold <laughs> on, I'm freaking out. You guys can you, you guys need to zip it. Okay. Okay, we were going down this way and he <sighs> scared me. I know. Alright. I will, Derp, so I'll go get some wool in a second. <laughs> Shadow Thief with the five dollar. <laughs> Thank you, Shadow Thief. I think this is the first live I've caught for hardcore. And I feel like I'm here to watch you die. <laughs> You die a bit when I catch a phasma on Among Us, so I'm a jinx. No, you're not. You're wonderful. You're wonderful. You stick around. If I die, then we will we know whose fault it is. All right, here we go. No, it's not going to be your fault. It's going to be my fault for going in here all stupid and not listening to derps just telling me to get some wool. Which we'll get some eventually. But for now, I just want to get closer. I want to get closer. I want to get closer. As close as we can. Don't fall in, skiz. <laughs> That would be bad news. Miss Teach with the ten dollar. <laughs> Thank you, Miss Teach. I've had the most frustrating day. AC needs to be replaced and will cost so much. Thanks for the fun distraction. Oh, Miss Teach, I've been there. I swear I have. That that's I'm so sorry to hear this. In the summer, you cannot go without AC, man. And I don't know where you live, but here in Arizona. So when I first moved into this house, the AC units and and to the credit of, you know, we bought the house. They were very honest. They were like, just want to let you know, this AC is like 22 years old. There's two units, right? Because it's a two-story house. So then you fast forward the clock and we lived here like three years. And then it was like, then they, then they went bad. Because they, at that point, they were a quarter century. I'm like, okay, we got to bite the bullet, man. We got to get new AC units. So we did. It was like $14,000 to get new AC. And they just, like the company just, they just like could not install it correctly. I'm not joking when I say they had to come out and repair it like more times than I, I it was got to a point. I was like, guys, I'm an extremely like, you know me, I'm nice and everything. I'm like, I'm an extremely patient person and I understand that things happen, but, but I need you to keep fixing this until it, you don't have to come back again because I don't want to deal with this anymore. And, uh, and it was funny because the first time they came out, so I, I put in brand new AC and guys, this is me. Okay. <laughs> you guys know me. I'm a really nice guy and I am, I'm, I'm very, I'm very patient. You know, look at this. I'm very patient. And, uh, they, I paid $14,000 for these new AC units. Miss teach. I took all the bad luck for AC. So you're not going to have to deal with any. Okay. That's where I'm going. And actually the person who has the worst luck with AC is actually impulse. 
because all the good luck he experiences in life, the universe writes itself when it comes to cooling devices. All of his AC, all of his computers, all, all, all his refrigerators, all his freezers, they're always breaking. Anyways, so I paid like the 14,000 for the for this and they came out and the guy did it and he just apparently didn't know what he was doing. He was actually let go like a week after he installed. They had to come out several times, but the first time they came out to repair, it was like, it was like a, a week after I installed it or they were installed a week. Guy comes out and he repairs it and then he writes up the bill and, and he's like, so the, you know, the service charge or whatever. I'm like, yeah, I'm not paying that. And I, and I was like, super nice. I'm like, I'm, I'm, I'm telling you, I'm not paying that. I'm like, you guys installed these a week ago. It was $14,000. You have to come back a week later. I'm not paying this. And he's like, that's actually a good point. So then he looks into it. He's like, yeah, I don't know. What I was thinking this has been waived. <laughs> All right, here we go. I'm scared people. How am I supposed to get down there? Yeah, drop sand down there or something. That's going to cause a big old mess. Not to mention, I am eventually going to have to build a stairway up here. Oh, this sucks. Look at the ancient city. We're exploring the ancient city in hardcore. Water might work. I was thinking about water. You know what? I'm going to do that. I like that idea a lot. I was thinking about water. We're going to do that. Right. Here's what I need to do. It's officially time. Uh oh, look what I did. It's officially time, people, to go um get wool, and we'll make a stair a, a stairs out of wool on the way up. All right, so we'll water down and the stairs out of wool. Ooh. Oh, Ooh, let's do this, dude. Hold on, check it out, dude. Ready? 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 Let's do. It. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, I better set off that trigger, dude. All right, let's get out of here. All right, we're going back. <laughs> mm. That's right. You can use carpets now. That was a, uh, in the beginning, we assumed you could use carpets, but I proved that you couldn't, but that was on a previous snapshot, and now you can, so that's good. So I think I should actually start a giant sheep. This is, this is hardcore. Okay. I should start a sheep. I should start a sheep farm and, uh, and get as much wool as we can. I don't know where I'm going to find sheep though. This is, we're going to, we might have to travel a little bit. Warden approaches. Oh my gosh. Forget it. Get in here. Oh, my bed's out here. Hop, hop. My bed's soaking wet. Ah, oh, I got a blow on it. <sighs> Put it by the torch. Dry it off a little bit. There we go. Okay. I know I hate it when I leave my bed outside. Yeah, we got ourselves a skulk sensor, dude. In hardcore nooch. All right. All right, let's clear this out a little bit. I don't like I don't like the way this looks. Let me look around, make sure nothing's gonna fall on my head. It's not a very safe zone. I'll tell you that much. Not a safe zone at all. Okay. Cut, let me. Cut, I, I I just feel like I just want to open this up a little bit. And then let's find some sheep. Some sheepy sheep. How may that is? Okay. All right. Let's see if we can find. Let's 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 shoot up in the sky. Let's find some sheep. Can I get some? Just like one, one sheepy sheep. Did I turn off mobs or something? There's a skelly over there. Hey, skelly. Skelly. Did you see any sheep, buddy? Hmm. Nooch. I should go get that XP. I should not mess around. I should get this XP. All right. Chickens. Did you see any sheep? 
That's what, you know what? I don't even have any hay on me. When I find sheep, what am I going to do? Oh, these pigs make me miss, miss Cloberta. Cloberta was a little pit bull puppy I was fostering. She's at her forever home now. But she would go. It was so cute. There's cows. Okay, so I guess we're going to find every animal there is except sheep. You can also get XP breaking the skulk blocks with a hoe. Is that true? I didn't know that. Is that really for real? Because I got diamonds. Might as well make a diamond one. Actually, you know what? One of those chests in there is going to have the sickest hoe in it. Look at this. There's every passive animal except for sheep. All right. Here. All right. This. This. I've had it. So here's what I'm gonna do. We're gonna let me let me do this. Maybe there's a village nearby. Okay. Let me just look around for a second. I wish I could just float and pause and look. Come on. Show me a village. Give me something here. Give me a village. Pumpkins. Nothing. Are you kidding me with this? Okay, I think I got lost. I think I turned I think I looked at chat and turned around like an idiot. Unless I'm over here. No, there I am. Okay. All right. No villages around. Oh, sheep. Okay, good, good, good. All right. All right, all right, all right. So we're good. We're in business. All right, so I'm going to... Let me build a little area right here. You sheep will do just fine. You guys are great. I need to get some... I need to get some... For you. Let me get some wheat. Uh, hop. And hop. Get these seeds. Sit tight, sheepy sheeps. I guess four is going to have to do. I got to create a farm. I'm going to do the whole thing here. And I got some. I got some bones on me. So, all right, this is good. You guys sit tight. We're in business here. Don't use all your rockets, skiz. That's what I. I got to be smarter, people. I'm not being very smart. Let me get the buckets. All right, so one, two, three, four, five, six. That'll do. And hop, and hop. All right, let's go make a little thing. And I, oh, I need a hoe anyways. Should I make a diamond hoe? I mean, am I just crazy to do that? Too late, we're doing it. And where to go? I want more than two diamonds here. I guess three, well, four. All right. All right, I'm doing a diamond hoe, people. You can't stop me. Well, I am. Diamond hoe. Oh, there we go. Yeah, okay. Derps with 100 bits here. You're right, it's time. While I'm making this, we're going to listen to Ebony's Skiz Hardcore song. See a schism man bounding around at night. You can guarantee that he's trying not to lose his only life. And if he just happens to want to venture to a dangerous land, you can pay your butt that he's going with an iron sword in hand. Did you ever see a schism man wandering around the woods? You can guarantee that he's out there. Can chat feel good And if he just wants to risk his life On the way to 200 more There's just no stopping him after all This is Skiz Hard Chords Skiz Hard Chords Skiz Hard Chords It's a man on a mission He don't need permission To make it to 200 or more On Skiz Hard Chords I love it. I love it. That's what I'm talking about. Isn't it such a great song? Go 
four or five there. One, two, three, four. Oh, that's fine. Don't need a lot here. Just need enough to breed these little guys. Stupid grass. Oh my gosh. This grass is so annoying. Oh boy. Get off of me. Stop it! All right, give me the seeds. And let's get this going. And uh, they're good. Get that going now. And I wish I had, I thought I must have just left all the bones back or something. At least I can do that. Give me some more of this good stuff. All right, so now, now, now we're moving a little bit. Let that go for a tick. And we only have one of these. I gotta start breeding these sheep. And let's go make a bunch of fences. Let's make them a little pen. Oh, I'm going to end up going through my rockets because I built this in a weird place. And we're going to have to maybe look for gunpowder at night. Hmm. We should also start looking for paper. Because 51 rockets is not a lot. 51 rockets, not a lot. Not a lot at all. Northern Philly with a 500 bits there. Thank you very much for that, Northern Philly. Okay, um, let's do it out of birch. Birchy birch. That's what we're gonna do the fences out of. Uh, hop and hop. Yeah, three should be enough. What is happening right now? Oh, I need sticks too. I forgot about that part. All right, 27. Any more than that, obviously. We might have to get some more wood. Gosh darn it. All right, whatever. Let's just get it started here. For, oh, let's go ahead and get some shears going. Boop, boop. I thought I had shears. I do not. Look at this. How do you have an elytra in hardcore but no farms? Well, the reason is because my actual hardcore world, oh, this is day, we're on day 363. It started in 118 and it's like thousands of blocks away from us. So what happened is I generated in 119 and then we went, we had to travel a great distance so that we could uh, find new land. And so now it's a whole new world. It's a whole new world. And so that's why, but I digress. I'm in your camp on this one. I, it would, I had this like, it's like starting all over. That's okay. All right, let's start with this guy here. And let's build this little uh, sheep font, sheep pen. Just right here. This will is right where that, right where they're comfortable, right? These are good, these are good little sheepies. One, two, three, four, five, six. We'll just do a little small one until I get more wood. Gosh, this grass is so annoying. It's getting dark. Dirky dark. Okay, so sheepy sheeps. Hey, how may I ban it? Hop. Not you, cows. Sheeps. Sheep. Sheep, 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 and nooch. All right, you guys stay put. Okay, don't let anybody hurt you. Oh, I got what we know. Might as well grab what I can so far. Gimme, gimme, gimme. And I'm just gonna breed the white ones because I don't wanna deal with having to switch back and forth. We're gonna do all white. Can I pick it up? Give it to me. All right. Gonna go sleep now. Time to sleep. Oh, I should really hunt for gunpowder when it's nighttime. Ah! Oh! Actually, what I should do is light this place up around here. This is very reckless. Hard core. Skiz. Don't you listen to Ebony's music? It's Skiz Hardcore. All right. Nap time. I left wool behind. We'll go get that. All right. 
let's put the wool I did get here. And then let's go get some more birch trees. I like the idea of taking, let, let's go check out what you're talking about. Let me see if I can get more XP. With, I didn't know you got XP by uh, mining Skulk with a hoe. Let's check this out. <laughs> I am Maverick Everdeen. Okay, let's, where, where, where did I come out of? Like that one time, let's go in here. Time for me to grab a bite. Hungy, dungy, wonky, chunky, monkey. Okay, let's get in here. Let's mine all of this. Okay, I really get XP. I do get XP for that. What about these guys? All right. Okay, first things first, dude. I need the XP so I can fix my, uh, my bow, but let's fix this pick because we cannot afford to lose this. This is amazing, by the way. This is, this is amazing. I cannot believe I didn't know that this is a thing. Now I feel like a dum-dum. I ha oh, I might. Oh, it's not silk touch. That's why I'm not getting it. Up. Look how fast it comes up with a hoe, dude. Okay, it's good for the hoe. I mean, good for the pick. Very dark in here, though. Don't love that. Okay. I'm going to light this place up a little bit more. Making me nervous. <laughs> Death fate. <sighs> All right. <laughs> uh, sorry, you just made me think of a great office scene. Like, I'm not going to say it on stream, but you know, I love the office, the TV show so much. It just really got me. You got me thinking. Rocket soccer with a hundred bits here. The master warden catcher. Glad I could catch your stream today. Man, eh? I'm glad you're here. Love streaming. Look at that dude. That's the ancient city right there, folks. All right. Ooh. Look at that pick. Look how good my pick is doing. Okay. I'm going to switch gears now. We're going to take this pick out of the hand and let's actually start getting XP because I really want to fix my bow. I need 33 XP for that. How's my... All right. Ho's doing all right. 28. This could be a lot. This could be a while. Ooh, it's good stuff here. Don't fall in that hole. Skip. Getting reckless here. Right, the rest I'm going to have to get from breeding the sheep, I suppose. Stupid spider wanting to be a part of my little... This is my, this is my world, spider. You just living it, homie. Okay. Let's not get too reckless here. We could really fall... Oh, if I fell down there, I, I just would be, it would be done. It would be so done. You can't let that happen, man. Can't let that happen. All right, let's get out of here. You hear that? I hear a spider, I feel like. Dude, it is a spider. Why is that spider trying to crawl on my face? All right, back up we go. We got some XP there, which is good. But back up we go, dude. Seven months ago, Mumble made an XP farm with Skulk. Seven months ago? <laughs> really? Well, I get the bow's not mending. So, and the reason it's not mending is because it's infinity. You know what I mean? What's on deck for your next Imp and Skiz series? Good question. Honestly, it's probably going to be our podcast. That'll probably be the next thing we do. Probably. You know what I mean? We're excited about it too, ma'am. Okay, we got to get back over there now. I'm going to get a bunch of this birch wood here. There's some sheep over there. There we 
go. We need lots of fences. Infinity plus one arrow is greater than ending. Yeah. Yeah, I do. I really like infinity like a lot, um, but having to pay a lot of XP to repair the bow over and over, you know, there's got to be a trade off. You, know, you can't have the perfect thing. Although, am I crazy? I was thinking how cool would it be to have an enchantment that's like the everything enchantment, just a tool, like an enchantment you can apply to a tool where just the tool can do anything and everything. Meaning like dirt, sand, stone, all the same. Every block there is, it's just an instant mine. Insta mine. Uh, you, you can't put mending on it. You know what I mean? So you can put on breaking up, but no mending. That would change the game because what it would do is it would end up like people would find out how to make farms to make sure that they have plenty of that enchantment. You know what I mean? Or whatever. Okay, this should be enough. Okay, we're not using tor we're not using rockets. Yes, I am. <laughs> that lasted. <laughs> I can't the, the idea of not flying. I just like I'm not on board. I love flying, and so there. Oh, that's what I that's what I do. Oh boy. Give me those fences. Shoes. Let me borrow that top. Um let's go like this and like that. Let's get some more fences. That's enough. All right. I want a big area for the sheep because we need to breed them. And we need we need to do it quickly, too. And I really should find some sugar cane, too. Keep your eye out for sugar cane, everybody. Keep your eye out for sugar cane. Almost went in there. Where's all the seeds? Why can't I get proper seeds here? I'm building an actual, like, fundamental day one farm right now. And yes, I have an elytra. <laughs> the tool for mining glass uh, should just be those suction cup things that they use to hold windows. Nice. Do I think of those suction cup things? I think of what, how they're used for, like, to, like, climb buildings like a spy. That's what I think of. Come on, grass. Get busy. Yeah, we're, we're going hunting tonight. We're going to get plenty of bones and plenty of gunpowder. We're not going to sleep through the night. We have to get some goodies. And I got to find some sugar cane. Because we might have to make some paper. What's up, Lady Birdie Bop? By the way, Lady Birdie Bop is somebody whose name I've changed. Because uh, so I, I should let you know that if you're watching the skids, you're at risk. Okay, you're at risk of me changing your name. This is what I do. Isn't that right, Pearly Pop? I gave Pearly Pop her name like back in Legacy days, and that's like everybody calls her Pearly Pop now. Everybody does. Impulse is Dipple Dop. Tango is not only Tango Top. I changed it yesterday. I, I added to it. He's now Tango. He's Tango Top Golf. And uh, Zed is Zettel Bop. Look at Bop. You think Bop's name was Mosel Bop? It was Mosley. I changed it to Mosel Bop. <laughs> That's right. Soka Soka Sop. I never changed Bunny's name. I think Bunny Bond is just too perfect of a name. I just got like I was like I couldn't touch it. Hein Welters, don't you sit there and try to do reverse psychology on me. Don't you even. <laughs> Vonder Vomen, gifting that sub over to Canuck, which is a fun name to say. Both of those. Vonder Vomen. Von, oh, no, that's like Wonder Woman. Vonder Vomen. That's what it is, right? Like a German way of saying Wonder Woman. That's Vonder Vomen. <laughs> Am I saying it? Did I get that right? 
You should really consider making at least a basic mob farm suit. I'm not going to be sticking around here. That's for true. I'm not going to stick around here for too long. Um, I really thought I had more bones. I must have left all the bones of the old gig. Well, no bother. When it when it is nighttime, we're going hunting, people. Hey, Skiz, watched your stabby stabby VOD. Was great. Would, lo would watch live, but it's in the middle of the night for me. That sucks. I get it. I get it. Do I hear a jerk face in the water? Oh, it's nighttime. Look at this idiot down here. You got nothing, dude. Just so you know. Are right, you sit there and act like you're scary. I Keep an eye out for creepers, Skiz. That would be great. Okay, it's time. Let me empty my pockets and we're going we're going to go hunting. Don't need the egg. Don't need that. Don't don't need that. Don't need that. Actually, keep this in yeah. Oh, I need to have a butt. Always have a butt on you. You never know when an Enderman's gonna come be a jerk face. Keep that there. Keep that there. Um leather boots. And this should do nicely. Okay. It's hunting time, people. We need creepers. We need skellies. Okay. Here we go. Hey, spider. What's that time about it? Okay. Creepy. <laughs> Whoa. Shut it up. Don't blow up. Whoa. All right. For the first time ever, I want skellies. Let's kick up the music for this hunt, dude. Now, if a creeper keeps up on me, you're not going to hear it. Dodge! Getting the bones. Yep. Need the bones. Oh, I just heard a creeper. Whoa! It's a creeper party. Woo! Oh boy! Whoa! <laughs> It's because these skellies. Crack! I need it. Where's my food, man? Just a little reckless. <laughs> yes, it is. I gotta get out of here. Okay. Oh, stupid little kid. Look at that. It's a little villager kid. Totally reckless. <laughs> Woohoo! Okay, I'm ready for daytime now. Getting some good XP, getting the bones that we need, getting a little bit of gunpowder, right? We're, yep, well, not much. Oh man, that means this song is not good for a hunt. 
The whole hardcore series could end in this hunt. Oh boy. Dang it! We need a better song than this, dude. Oh, it's building up. Hold on. It's building up. Okay. I can deal. Okay. Keep going. place is a mess now a little music's a little loud but i'm loving this Woo! heart is pumping dude all right now they're in a fight because they're morons hey kb games hey! stop shooting Okay, I gotta go. Okay, enough. Stop shooting me. Love. Probably got. I'm probably look like a pin cushion. Get off my farm. Okay. I, I kind of want to hit F5, see what I look like. <laughs> oh, it's awesome. Oh, man. This is not how you're supposed to do hardcore, by the way. Not like this. Maybe on day one, but not on day 360, whatever we're on. Dude, look at this. <laughs> Ouch! Oh, gunpowder. Yes. Go fight amongst yourselves. I want the creepers. Probably got a good amount of bones. Woo! Now what we want to do is, is get a creeper to blow all these jerks up. That's always fun. Should we try that? Let's do it. Let's do it. Give me a creeper. Look at oh, look at this conga line. Come here, creeps. I got a job for you, buddy. I'm gonna take care of the spider because they're faster and they make me mad. Come here, buddy. <laughs> Could have been better. Love. Those bones. All right. Woo! Ah! Ooh! Ah! Ah! Okay. Let's let's blow these guys up, huh? Uh oh. Woo! I got stuck. I thought that was gonna be it, dude. Oh, it almost is. Woo! Okay, sun's coming up. You guys are gonna burn. Okay. Oh my gosh. Woo. Brought a, like a golden apple or something. Jerk. Didn't he see me dodge IRL? See what I mean? It triggers my wings and it slows me down and then I'm still in range and there they go. Okay. Woo, this place is a mess. Oh, I hear up, up, oh no. 
Okay. Well, I'm not going to mess with you. That's not going to happen. <laughs> Dummy. Okay. How's the creeper over here? You can turn the music down. Ah, I know I didn't use the shield like once. Okay. Let us... Oh, there's stuff down here. Let's look at the... Check our spoils here. So we got 22 gunpowder, which is really good, actually. Believe it or not, that's that's going to help us. Oh. oh. Well, you can carry a shield. I <laughs> know. You're not wrong. Okay. Now let's eat. Look around for creepers. Okay. Ooh. I'm not going to lie. That was a little bit nerve wracking. That was a little nerve wracking right there. We're going to have plenty of uh, wheat in just a second here. <gasps> you, <laughs> Benji, you uh, you used the shield exactly once. I didn't think I used it at all. All right, now let's get the bones here. And let's get some more wheat as quick as we can. Okay. At these sheep's breed, we're gonna build a much bigger pen. We're gonna have so much, so much carpet and wo just wool in general. It's gonna be great. Alrighty. I th I I hope I brought enough food. I feel like I brought enough food, but I went through uh, a lot of that steak in that that fight. Ah, you used it on the on the last deliberate creep, creeper blast. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I did. I used it on the last deliberate creeper blast. Whew. Okay. All right. Any seeds on me? One seed. <laughs> and two bone meal. Okay. Look at that. It's perfect. Gimme, gimme, gimme. All right, let me get all this and pick all this up and then replant. Yes, I can't even get all this. Anything I can get rid of? I don't need. I don't need ever need this rotten flesh. All right, now let's plant all this and then let's go breeding and let's build a bigger pen. We need we like I want to explore this ancient city big time and I want to have tons of wool for it. Exploring an ancient city and hardcore like I don't want to. Yeah, I can't say words right now. Uh, Nugget says I just joined. What did I miss? Well, you missed one epic night fight. I wanted to get some gunpowder and bones so I could fast track this uh, wheat for the sheep. We found an ancient city and I haven't gone in yet because I am not equipped. But we did find an ancient city, and that's super dupe. Okay, we're this has to be a very big area here. Okay, because they just go through the grass so fast. Ah, Popey! Do I have dirt on me? No! Let me, let me flatten this a little bit. Okay. I'll do. We'll go to here. How about this? We'll go to here. The grass is so annoying. We'll go to here. Yep. I wish they would eat the one in two high grass, right? They're just eating. Look at they're, You know what they're eating? They're eating like grass that's like, like a putting green. You know what I mean? They're using like the, the front two teeth. They're just like, nibble. Look at this grass here, dude. Hope. Oh, a big old bite of that. Okay. And I tell you, that's a nice thing about hardcore and temporary, like temporary worlds is that, you know what I mean? Temporary homes. You can just like, what kind of, who cares what kind of mess you make? All right, grass, keep growing, honey. Really? Uh, 
Okay. <clears throat> Remember, this is, this is the objective here is to have a sheep farm that's obnoxiously big. That's what we're going for. Here. All right, now carve this out. This is your new area, guys. See, look at all this room to roam. You guys are gonna be happy, 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 happy. You almost made me hit you with the axe. All right, look what I got for you guys. Num and nums. Hmm? And I'll find you somebody. How am I supposed to get out of here? Um, I gotta, I gotta get some carpet. Ah! All right, there was more sheep around here. Let's see if we can fast track this. Where's the baby? I hear it. Hey, little guy. <laughs> All right. I saw some sheep over here. If you want the grass to grow back faster, dig down so that there's an air block between the surface grass and another layer of dirt grass. Ooh, that is smart, Birdie Bop. That would be smart. That's something that would be fitting if I had the patience to do that. <laughs> it would take two seconds. And I'm just like, I don't have time for that. All right. All right. Hey, you look like you probably have a buddy around here, right? Where's your buddy? All right. Well, come with me, dude. Don't worry about Mr. Cow up here. This is this this wheat's for you, buddy. Nothing to see here, cow. Hold it right there, cows. Come on, sheep. Hey! Listen to me. He actually listened. I'm flattered. Cow, I don't I don't I don't need you. Although I might. Do you want to come in here, cow? Why don't you come on in? We'll do a cows and sheeps. Okay. We'll make ourselves some keeps. Get over here. See that? They stopped because they're like, that joke was so bad. I don't know if I want to spend eternity with this guy. We got a Richard in the house. What's up, Richard? What's up, RT? Richard. Oh, I got a black sheep over there. Get over here! I'm sorry to yell. Come on. Come on, 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 come on. Sheep. You stay out there, cow. Okay, now, you guys are... There you go, and... And there you go. Okay. Let the power of the exponent begin! Yeah, if I make some white dye, then I can get the black sheep in here. And you can get started. You want You want, You want? want to join us? Here, buddy. Come here, sheep. Come here. Hey. Hey! All right, so time to shear you guys. And I'm going to make carpet on this thing so I can get in and out. I really didn't... Re oh, they're right there in my face. They're right there in my face. And I don't have any bones on them. Okay, so I'm going to take this. And I'm over there, so I'll put that for me. And over here. We got I'm going to take this guy over here. We'll put it right over here. And there we go. There we go. Welcome, Raiders. Thank you for that raid. X Embrace. We are making a little sheep farm because I need wool because we're going down to the deep dark. We found an ancient city. It's hardcore world. No big deal. <laughs> Tell me when you guys are ready for the good stuff again. Any of you guys? Oh, all right. Uh-oh, no, I hit the wrong guy. That's my bad. We're going to get a gray one if I do this. All right, you guys got, you got to do your little cooling down, okay? Don't rush it. In the meantime, I'll do this. Um, I'll make my first crafting table of this world. All right. Okay. I want, I need you guys to grow and have a happy lives and I need you to do it fast. Did I miss a raid? Hmm. X embrace. Yeah, I got it. Yeah, the stormy. Stormy. 
attitude. Richard, this is crazy what I'm doing, buddy. Uh, by the way, if there's any chance you guys don't know who, who Richard Thornton is, uh, he's the uh, artist, the creator, the one and only behind the Naked and Scared theme song. When you wake in the morning, yawning, you're heading for a brand new day. You gotta get out exploring, for mobs will be spawning and coming your way. It's gonna be rough, times will be tough. You might feel like you won't make it through. There's 21 days and 1 million ways to do what you gotta do. You try to be brave when you head to the caves. Be careful when your health is shared. You're watching your backs when baby zombies attack. You know your whole my body is there when you're naked and scared. When you're naked and scared. When you're naked and scared. That is the naked and scared song uh, for the series that Impulse and I do, and Richard made that, and we love it. Ah! Okay, what's important is that we stayed calm just now. And uh, if there's any, I don't know, mods, did you throw out uh, Richard? There it is right there. Go go, go give this uh, chap a, a follow. He's outstanding. Hey, yeah, I said chap. I can say chap sometimes. All right, there. Look at that entrance. <gasps> Woo! I'm going to up the ante here. That's our entrance to the deep dark, folks. Let's do it right. I kind of want to put a different block there. What am I doing? All right. I'm being really silly right now, but let's take these guys. No, let's not. Let's just do more of this. All right. Everybody stop messing around. Okay. So, boop. All right. Now we're done. I'm really done. <laughs> Would you look at Lady Birdie Bop over here? Gifting out five subs. Let's get those buddy bombs going for Lady Birdie Bop. You're amazing, Lady Birdie Bop. Thank you for that. Okay, let's put this in there. Lady Birdie Bop, gifting out the five sub bomb. We got buddy bombs rolling for Lady Birdie Bop. Okay, so now let's um let's go see if they're ready to breed. We need this. We need them. Gosh darn it! I don't want to use these rockets, but that's why we got the. Let's. Oh. We gotta, we gotta find, we gotta find um, sugar cane. Let me see if I brought any. I, I, I probably didn't because I would have been smart. So let me see. No, no sugar cane. All right, we gotta find sugar cane pronto. These are all things we gotta do, okay? Because this, this, <laughs> this fire, this, this is, a, this is a bad situation. This fireworks are bad. I know. Up, oh, right, look at that, right there, dude. Woo! Okay, look at that. Just one stock. One little thing here and I'm okay with it. Give me that. Give me it. Give it. Morse code. Morse code gifting out 10 gifted sub bomb. Amazing. We need buddy bombs rolling. You know what? We need to we need to up it. We're we're up in the ante. People. People. I need broken skizzy emotes. Can we get some broken skizzy emotes. But the one, the only, the bot made for us, which is just amazing. You're amazing. Thank you very much for that Morse code. There it is. Look at those broken skizzy modes. <laughs> it's so good. Oh, look, we have visitors. Would you just look at that? Oh, my torch or my, 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 uh, my bow has seen better days. Well, you know what? Let's do this. Rock and roll. I'm not afraid of these guys. And I want that manner. Hey, idiots. Where's Flaggy? You don't even have Flaggy? You brought me nothing. You guys are morons on a whole new level. Yeah, your buddy just got shot there. By all means, just step out. I need... Where's Flaggy, dude? Hey! Oh, no! Oh, that's not good. Shoot this guy instead. That's Flaggy right there. Give it. I'm getting... <laughs> you just hit that, dude. Why don't you give me that? You know I want one of those. Are there two of you throwing... Two of you! Okay, let's not die this way. Ouch! 
I, I want a trident. You know I got... You guys know I want a trident. Okay. Eh. Stop it. It's not good what I'm doing here. It's very, very, very reckless. Ouchie! I gotta get out of here. Woo! Okay. The shield is not doing super. Okay, is the shield dead? It's dead. Look at these guys still shooting at me. Those are jerks. Okay. Let's, I want I, I to see if I can get a... They're still going for it. Are you seeing this? I never even got the banner. Well, come on over. Oh, he hit his buddy. <laughs> you shot your buddy, you dummy. Here we go, guys. We're going in. Swim fast. Swimming, dodging, going for the kill shot. Go in. I got looting. I uh, I want a trident. Look at that poor pig right there. He's like, that one was close. Oh, there it is. There it is. Give it to me. All right. Don't need to worry about a raid because we're not near a thing. Whenever there's more than one, I nope out. <laughs> All right. Let's, uh, this is a badge of honor right here. You know, this is not people know I don't mess around. All right. I, I don't like the fact that I'm not getting tridents. Look at this. Look what I have. I have looting three, dude. Isn't looting three the highest number? That was not good. Isn't looting three the highest number? Lolo cry with a 500 bits. Love your face, skips. But seriously, two trident guys and a broken shield. My heart can't take it. <sighs> oh, it's not like I'm playing hardcore. Oh, wait a minute. The thing is, there's a there's a cost of being awesome. Three's the highest. Thank you, Bunny Bond. You gotta take risks. You're like, are, are you are you claiming to be awesome? I mean, well, maybe. No, for real. I, this, this that was reckless. I get it. That was super reckless. But I'm okay with it. I this is like, I really want a trident. Like badly, dude. <laughs> We tried to get a Trident so many times, and those those guys were back-to-back -back Trident owners, and I couldn't get one. Is this thing ever going to go away, this bad omen? I can't do There were Tridents all over the place. Unless, what if it did, and I just missed it? What if that's one? No, it's a fish. That means they hit a fish, dude. They hit a fish, but they couldn't hit me. <laughs> Dummies. All right. Moving on. I don't have any milk, but I could get some. You're right. Let's drink some milk. Let's get rid of this bad omen. In case we happen to walk by a village. <laughs> let's get that bucket. In fact, yeah, let's do it. That's a good idea. Let's go milk. Let's go up to a cow and say, hey, buddy. Uh, don't mind me. I'm just going to reach underneath you here. And I uh, hope that's all right with you. See that? The cow saw me grab my buckets. They're like, I'm out of here. This guy has the roughest hands. He's a drummer. You want to know something? So back back in high school, you guys are gonna this is gonna you're gonna be like, what? I had to, I sand I used to sand my hands with actual sandpaper a lot. And here's why. Can you milk goats? You can't milk goats. Can you milk goats? Where's the cow, dude? I used to sand my hands, yeah, because, well, because I was a drummer and a gymnast. And if you, as a gymnast, if you don't sand your hands, you you increase your chances of uh, of ripping. And ripping is the worst. It's the worst. I ri Oh, I would get big, gnarly rips. My, oh, it was so gross and so painful in the shower after you'd rip on the high bar. So anyways, I used to sand my hands a lot between drumming and, and gymnastics. I was, my hands were always, the skin was extremely like strong skin, but like really smooth at the same time. I used to do it in class. My teachers would be like, can you not do that? Yeah, that's really gross. 
All right, there goes the bad omen effect, and we need to eat something. You guys hear my dogs? Uh, let me tell you what Kevin Bubbles Malone Refrigerator Jimmy Matty Dugan does every morning. Okay, I get up, I get dressed, and, uh, and, and I get ready for our walk. And I go down, and I try to just go downstairs calmly, but he sees I've got shoes on and a hat, and he's like, it's walk time. So does he go like, like, does he jump up and down? Does he get excited? Does he, you know, what does he do? You know, this is what he does. Whoa, 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 whoa. He is so excited. He just yells and screams and it's unbelievable. And then him and Griff, once we start the walk, they start fighting. They don't actually fight to like those. They love each other, but it looks like they're trying to fight to the death. And it's not. They're just both so excited to walk. We walk every morning and they, they act like they haven't walked in a hundred years every day. It's unbelievable. I don't want to deal with any of your black wool, buddy. All right, I'll take it. Okay. I can roll, people. All right, and as soon as this sugar cane's ready, this look at us. We have. Like, <laughs> you know what we should do is we should really start building out here where it is that we want him to track us, like where we're gonna where we're gonna trap him. Do you know what I mean? And that's probably what we'll do pretty soon, actually. Because I'm not going to lie to you. I'm pretty nervous about this whole thing. <laughs> Get a flower to dye the sheep. Ooh, that's a good one. Yeah, a flower will do it. You're right. There's probably white flowers everywhere over there. Right there. All right. Give me that. Light gray. I don't want that. I want white dye. That's not the right flower. It's got to be uh, this guy right here. It's got to be the this one. That's that we, how do we pronounce this? We this is the uh, azul blue bleh. Oh, it's still light gray. It's got to be bone meal. Has to be bone meal. Fine, fine. In any case, uh, what we should do? It's got to be bone meal to get white dye. And that's okay. That's what he sounds like in the morning. And while we're leaving the cul-de-sac, I'm like, Kevin, that is really rude. People are still sleeping. Shut up. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. But I love him so much. It's ridiculous. It is. It's ridiculous. I baby him. I baby my Kevin Bubbles. All right, let's. Oh, I didn't put the wheat back. All right, so let, let's have it. Let's start to get our head wrapped around what this is going to be like, right? So if we come, if this is where we're going to bring him up, okay, let's not die that way, skis. Jeez, Did you guys see that, dude? You want to hug the doggo? He, Gryffindor. I I hug Kevin all the time, and he's pretty good about it. Gryffindor is a great hugger. He'll come up on you like this. Kevin will just like put his head down and let you hug him. <laughs> white lilies make white dye. All right, look at that. All right, oh, do I have water on me? No. I was gonna use water to get down here. All right, let's go get some water and let's give this a go. Because our objective is we really need to create a stairway all the way up here. I'm really. It's it's cool that we found an ancient city, but it would have been nice. Just wings. Should I fly a little bit? Let's do. All right, let's let's see here. This is this is very reckless. We got to open this up big time if we're gonna pretend we're gonna fly back into this thing, dude. You know what I mean? Okay, let's open this way up. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh. I'm nervous. Ooh. Oh. We gotta open this way up. Where is it? Okay. What do you think? I'm so nervous. <laughs> I wanna fly down in there, but this is super reckless, dude. We really should be, we should think this through, but we're gonna do it. Oh, 
what could possibly go wrong? What are your chances of dying this stream? It might be kind of high. I didn't bring, I brought some wool. I did actually bring some. But right, I just want to fly down there a little bit. That's actually not a bad idea. What if I could like put this down? You know what I mean? And like land on it. Now there's wool already down there. So if we can land on that, that would be a pretty boss thing too. But what's more important is we got to make sure that if we have to fly out of here, we can actually find this hole. Okay. <laughs> I get nervous. I don't want to get nervous. I want to live. I want to live, Marge. Why won't you let me live? Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Woo! Why'd I do it like that? I gotta get over here. Okay, let me clear this out. <laughs> okay, let's find where there's wool down there. I just can't. It's so dark in the deep dark, dude. It's like way too dark. I can't find I can't find the pattern. Like there's there's hallways of wool. I just can't. Are we above like the awesome structure? Like we're above the, the, are we above the redstone room, dude? I think we're above the redstone room. Can I possibly do this? Can I go down there, fly around and make it back up here safely? This feels like extra reckless. Oh, uh, yeah, I should do a lot of torches around the hole so I can find it. Let's do that. All right. I don't know if I should do it. I don't want to do it. Okay. What about this? Let's try to land right there, dude. Ready? Ouchie. That was grumpy hard. <laughs> it was at this moment. He knew he messed up. I feel like I'm above the, like, I'm, I feel like I'm directly above that cool structure. Am I not? Ooh. Stop telling on me. I'm above that structure, dude. Yeah, I don't have any potions. Oh. Don't die, skits. It's not bad advice. If anything, what if I just built a ladder? Well, I got to build a stairway, though, man. Otherwise, he's never. I'm never gonna get him up here. Gosh, this is, I'm never going to be able to find. I don't want to do it. Let me think. I'm thinking. I'm thinking. Okay. What if I just fly and land somewhere? It's too reckless, dude. It's too reckless because if I try to fly out, I could also die by kinetic energy trying to fly out of here. All right. I'm thinking. Because like I said, I'm going to, I'm going to have to build a stairway of wool all the way. So let's, let's get back up. I don't want to die just yet. I don't want this thing to, I don't want it to die like this. It's like, you know what I mean? <laughs> if only you had night vision. I know. What? Is, ah, I don't have any potions. <laughs> yeah. Okay. 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 We need much more wool and we're going to build wool stairs. That's what we're going to do, dude. You're scared now, says Maximus. A water elevator? I don't have any soul sand. That would be huge. By Connecticut Energy. <laughs> Did I say Connecticut instead of Kinetic? Did I say Connecticut? <laughs> he won't follow you up the wool stairs properly. Are you sure? Like, are you, is that for real? What happened here? Oh, I know what happened. Okay. 
I really need that sugar cane to grow, please. How we doing, guys? Oh, it's getting warm out here. Oh, boy. Man, come on, guys. All right. Whew. All right. This sugar cane is growing too too slow. Hey, grew it. Did you grow it? Did you grow it all? No. Why is it so slow? <laughs> Honestly, Skiz is more likely to die to an Enderman while the warden is chasing him. That is, you're not wrong about that. All right, let's go. Let's go get started on these stairs. Okay, so let me grab this bucket. Let's see what happens when we do the water. And it's getting late. Nuts. Space Monkey, well that resub, this was supposed to be for your birthday, but I was too late. I missed this three minutes ago. Uh, but I was too late for the stream. Thank you for all the laughter and crazy moments. Best wishes from my hubby Joe, myself, and my two cats. Space Monkey, thank you very much for that. That's awesome. Thank you. Jeez, I gotta stop doing that. Why do I do that? Now you can wrap any of the yeah the shriekers with wool while you build the stairs. That yeah, that I can do. Okay, so here's the deal. I'm gonna turn this back down again because I really need to be thinking with my face. Give me this. All right, here we go, people. Ready? Are you guys ready? Let's check this out. Okay. I'm gonna take out all those candles. Down now. We're gonna go down. Actually, we're gonna go down. We're gonna do it over here. No, I, no, we're not gonna do that either. We're gonna do it right. Mm, right here. Okay. Oh, look what I did! I made a big old mess. I gotta do this. I gotta get rid of all this. Did I make an infinite water source there? No. There we go. Whew. Okay. Yeah, you're right. I think I think I'm just gonna find. So this is got to find a way to do the stairway properly. This is not gonna be easy given how low that is, man. So right now. So 6145, okay, negative 6145 and 894, 894, negative 6145. Maybe we can do some counting down there and when to, you know, where to start. Okay, now, now it's go time. That water's still trying to clear up down there. Wrap it up, water. Okay, one, two, three, okay, hold on. Can't make a decision. I need that water to disappear. All <laughs> I don't like go time. Can you bring snowballs to distract the shriekers if need be? The shrieker, well, you don't want, you, the shriekers will just launch them, but you can distract the warden with them, but I don't have any snowballs. This is me. I, this is, I'm, I'm stalling. Stop messing around, Skiz. Enough. Okay, enough of this nonsense. Come on. Let's do this. Hurry up, water. Otherwise, you're going to be all stupid. Okay, now it's go time. We're going to go down there. Whew. I had a couple eggs back in the gig. In my in my little house back there. Look at, look at this. I'm supposed to loot this place and I got all this garbage in my pockets. All right, here we go, guys. It's going down. We're in the deep dark now. 
That is that main structure, dude. Look at that. That's that main structure. That means that we're right above the, the redstone room. A little bit of air. Okay. Okay. Can you guys see? Is it way too dark? Gosh, I wish I had night vision. I want to get over there. I want to get, I want to get, look at that shrieker right there, dude. Is that a chest? Man, I wish I had Swift Sneak. Popped in to see how pros play this game, but ended up watching Skizzle. <laughs> yeah, if you want pros, you're in the wrong gig. Okay, I'm not going to worry about getting into the redstone room. I'm gonna I'm gonna block over there. Oh, is that wool right there? This is I can't see much. That's wool right there. It's so dark. I'm gonna lay down a torch now. This is very bad. Bad idea. Here it goes. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Look at this. That those are those are those are that's that's wool. Let's keep going. Let's see if we can get over to that chest. See if we can wrap it and and uh, like wrap it in wool and open it. There's a, I thought I saw a chest over here. I really wish we had like could put down torches in a quiet way. Where's the, where's that? I thought I saw a chest. There must be one over there. Okay. Whew. Why wool? Wool is what keeps your, um, keeps your, your toes quiet. So all these things, that little wavy thing, that's a skulk sensor. And, uh, when every step you take, even if I eat something and I, you know, you always burp when you eat, it sets them off. And if they're near shriekers, they, they summon, they have the potential to summon the warden, but wool keeps you stepping lightly. Where is the, uh, I'm, gonna, I'm running out. I'm running out of wool. We're going to have to go back up to my sheep farm. Look at that. See that? That's a, that's a sensor right there. Okay. We got to go back. We got to go back. We got to go up this. Okay. Go up now. Going up. We go back up now. Woo! Get me out of here. Okay. Well, we got in. <laughs> oh boy. Well, let's get back up. Let's get some more. You're bridging over a big wool path. I know. I totally am too. But it's not like complete. Oh, I should make another shield. Not that the shield will do anything against the warden. It'll do nothing against the warden. In fact, every time you use the shield, like you raise it up, it sends out a sound signal. So grab some soul sand and make a bubble elevator. I don't know, that's gonna be a lot of work, but it would be nice to be able to get out of there quickly. Okay, let's take a quick nap. Okay, and then let's go get some more wool and let's breed them some more. We're, we're eventually, we want to get to a place where we have so much wool, it's obnoxious. Why don't you guys have hair? Look at this. Okay, we got all sorts of colors now. I'm just going to have to deal with it. Okay, do your thing, guys. There we go. Man, that's so much garbage. 
Empty your pockets, guys. How about how about that? Hmm? That's an idea. 31 XP. We got in once we have 33. We can we can uh we can fix our fix our thing. Bob with 365 bits. That's a Minecraft year in hardcore. <laughs> Wait, is that what I'm at? Look at that, 368. Dude, you're right, Bob. We, we are, we have crossed a year in Minecraft in hardcore. I mean, come on. And that's without like using totems and, and, and no AFKs. I mean, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Now, apparently uh, the sugarcane rule is completely broken. What is wrong with these guys? Grow! In fact, we're going to need a lot of paper. I might as well get that going right now. Let me do that right now. Bum, 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 bum. We'll do it really quick. Nothing fancy. We'll do it right here. Okay, you take that tree down. Let's level this here. Like I said, nothing fancy. There's something. Where's my wheat farm? Over there somewhere? There it is. Okay. Okay, and let's just go right here. That'll be just fine. Man, look at look what I got in my pockets. Break and replace the sugar cane, definitely. 100%, that's what I'm going to do. And I'm going to do it here. And uh, in fact, let me just build out this whole thing real quick. I know, let's, let's get that planted so it's moving what would you look at my pockets people I gotta keep getting this wool this is this is priority Darn it. This is what I'm talking about, Skiz. Put yourself out. Okay. Man, light gray wool and stone looks like so similar. Yeah, sand or dirt doesn't matter. Scroll mode intensifies. <laughs> That's exactly what happened to. <laughs> Shut up! Hold on, I'm gonna get this done. Good. One more and I'll have an infinite water source. Sugar cane's more visually appealing on sand. Ooh, that, that's that, I can I can get on board with that. Sugar cane, get this going here because this is just ridiculous. And boom, boom. Okay. I'll worry about expanding this as soon as I get some actual sugar cane there. Look at that. They're already growing back. You guys are good. Boy! Let me, let me get rid of some stuff here. This is nuts. Too much garbage. Too much garbage. There's a good one. There's a good one. Uh, why don't you keep this in the garage? We, we, we don't have a garage. Oh, did I say garage? I meant garbage. <laughs> I've done that name before, but I just love it. Did I say garage? I meant garbage. <laughs> it's not very far. Oh, the string to wool. That's right. Think about that. All right, this is going good now. We're getting some, we're just some good wool, and I think they're almost be ready to breed again. I don't actually don't I actually don't know what the interval is for the breeding thing. 
Not Family Guy. You know what? Soulless. I saw that. I, I'm seeing just little bits and pee. Not friends. Oh, it is friends. It is friends. It is friends, Bunny One. Yeah. I can't believe I said not friends. It's friends. Five minutes to breed, 20 to grow up. Okay. Gotcha. Um, yeah, the, the, the Yellowstone's going all haywire, man. Are you seeing this? It's crazy. Okay, there's a lot of good wool. Okay, let's take this white wool. Let's let's keep on keeping. Let's go back down. This is, this is what we're doing. We're waiting. How's that sugar cane? <laughs> sugar cane's broken or something. The same time for things to despawn. Yeah. You don't have a trident. Compost extra organics for bone meal. Yeah, that's a good idea too. Might do that. It's just, it's like, I like setting those up with like hoppers and stuff because it really cooks, you know? Go back down here. Whoop. Look at this, Revering Tail getting out five subs. Let's get those butter bombs going for Revering. Thank you, Revering. Give them a five sub gift bomb. How my bad Oh, I gotta eat. Revering, amazing. Thank you. Look at that. Thank you for being amazing. Oh, you're too nice. You're too nice. You guys are too nice to me. Let me keep it up. But... All right, here we go. Um, we're going back down, guys. Okay, we're going back down now. <sighs> I really, really, really want night vision. <laughs> it's so hard to see in here, dude. All right. Yeah, so I'm. I was. I was bridging out. Oh, I just want to keep going until I can find a chest. There's great stuff in the chest in here. I need a, a name tag would be helpful. Okay. This is all about just treading lightly. Like, don't mess around. You know what I mean? Tread lightly. What is happening? Why can't I not find? Oh, is that a chest right there? That's it. Way over there. All right, let's go straight that way and then we'll cut left if we need to. I should have emptied my pockets. Yeah, right. What am I doing? I'm not going to be able to pick anything up. The warden, if I wake him, he's going to be so grumpy. Okay. Okay. Ooh. Up. 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 Where is the chest? We gotta go that way now. We only have six left. We're gonna go back. It's gonna be a journey. It's gonna take a while to do this. We gotta be cool with it. Okay. I got to tell you something. Okay. Look at that. That's, that's that cool room, man. To the Minecraft developers. Well done on the Asian city. It's, it's the, the fear is real. <laughs> I mean, it. the fear is, is the fear is legit. Going back up. Okay. All right, music. Yeah, the black and gray rule, wool I left upstairs. <laughs> because I'm brilliant. Well, so carpets will work. Um, but obviously I can't bridge with carpets. All right, bunny, you got it. My pockets will not be a problem when I go downstairs next time. <laughs> Thank you. 
and the wooden structure there's all yeah there are chests yeah so we're gonna wrap those chests in wool and so we can open those up how many golems does it take to kill a warden good question i don't know because i did a little test in creative like a golem and warden fight and the, it was ugly <laughs> the warden was just like Phew. smoked him what? You found an ancient city with no skulk sensors? That is like the world's greatest gift. <laughs> Slash glitch. All right. So do we really, Bop, do you really think it's going to be a problem if I make stairways uh, a stairway out of, out of wool? Is that for real? One golem and over a stack of iron to keep it healing. Oh, wow. Look at Ace. I guess I have to learn pocket management for when I start streaming. People don't like poor pocket management. It's hard to blame them. Um, there's always like, oh, I don't want to give her that one. Either. But I need blocks, dude. So I'm going to do tough. But everything else I'll get rid of. Obviously, we want the wool. Get rid of the dirt. Maybe dirt would be better. Now we're going to do tough. Um, I probably don't need this until I'm ready to heal. Don't need this garbage. Don't need that. I don't know why I'm carrying around a potato. <laughs> Man, I'm amazing. I don't need this. Look what I'm doing for you, bunny. Doing this for bunny. <laughs> All right, here we go. All right, now let's go get, uh, let's go get, let's go check. Is this nighttime? No, it's, okay. Uh, here's what I'm going to do also. Uh, we're we're going to, I'm going to bridge across. I know it sounds like a squirrel moment, but we're, we got to bridge. We got to do this. What I want to use? I'll use deep slate. Okay. I don't want, because I don't want to use torches anymore going back and forth. <laughs> you never bug me. You never bug me, buttons. Oh, yeah, a boat might have been a good idea. What's a clever way to get across this water quickly? Hmm. A bridge. Can you move that boat out of the way? I need the materials behind it so I can build a bridge. I don't know. I just channeled Brian Regan there. Okay, so... All right, here we go. Where's my guys? Way over here, huh? I have, I, I do have two butts. I got two butts in my pocket. Wow. That's, uh, that's, that's next level. That's next level. <laughs> All right. Okay. Okay, it's time to breed, guys, because I need more wool. You guys are not, you're not cutting it. Yes. And. All right. All right, do your thing. Where's all my XP from breeding you? And how's our, look at, what is, why is the sugar cane broken? Something wrong with the cane. Oops, I mean to do that. Don't want that nonsense. What is wrong with the sugar cane? Why is the sugar cane broken? So do I need to look for better sugar cane? We're, we're flying. We're looking for sugar cane now. There's some right there. There's some right there. Not a lot. Hey, a village. Could have brought you guys bad omen. Let's go see what you guys got. 
I'm going to rob you now. I hope you're cool with that. Wasn't I looking for a village for some reason? I can't remember. Why was I looking for a village? What was that? Oh, I'm going to get lost. I'm going to get turned around here. Where's your guys' stuff? Oh, for the wheat. That's right, the wheat. All right. I saw my last video. Yeah, help yourself. You guys just don't believe in chess at all, or what's going on? Hey, diamonds! I'll take all this stuff I don't need. <laughs> I'm the worst. You know what I want to do? Oh, maybe we'll do that another time. That would be pretty boss. Ride a horse around the ancient city. Just like, what's up, Warden? You got nothing! <laughs> I can't double click these for some reason. They too need the power of pocket management. Yep. Hey, cows. Hold it right there, cows. Anything deep? Terrible host. I'm gonna leave the door open. I'm a terrible guest. All right, I'm out of here. This place sucks. Okay, so where I came from over here, right? Over there. All right, let's grab this sugar cane right here. And the sugar cane over here. Why does he say diamonds like that? It's skiz. You know, the truth is, you know, the first one to say it like that was uh, Impulse. We were filming a, you know, Naked and Scared series episode and he found diamonds and he's like, diamonds! And I just always thought it was so funny. So I've been doing it. Okay. Twenty four rockets, people. So bad. It's so bad. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Jewish Mastodon. Well, that prime sub. Thank you very much for that, Jewish Mastodon. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Okay, guys, you gotta get you gotta get to a point, sheep, where there's so many of you. The second I start right clicking, the, uh, my shears just break. That's how fast I want you growing your, your. How many of you I want, and how fast I want you growing it. That's too much to ask. Now, sugarcane. What I'm gonna need you to do is a little thing I like to call grow. They won't grow. It's frustrating. It will not grow. Okay, we got some more wool. Let's let's grab the rest of the wool and let's keep let's keep plugging. Oh, try and breed again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, you think it's been I think it's been a little brief, but let's see. Yeah. Yeah, none of them will breed yet. Okay, we'll come back in a few minutes. Look at my pockets are a mess again on. Okay. Ace Galaxy sends gets thoughts of Miracle Grow. Needs something. Something's wrong with the soil over there. All right, let's empty. We have our steak on us, so we're good. We have. Oh, I didn't grab the rest of the. Oh, I did. I got a little bit. That doesn't matter. Let's. Just... It doesn't matter. We're gone. We're going. Now I'm going back. I want as much wool as possible. I want to open one of these chests. I walk away for 10 minutes and come back with a gift sub. Thank you. Yeah, isn't that awesome? Now you get to do the broken skiz emotes. And let me tell you something else Bop's been like awesome about. He's like, get me some pictures of your dogs and we'll get together some good emotes. It's a great idea. I just got to get some pictures. It's a great idea. OK. 
Okay, and I'm hungry. Is this the craziest thing? Look at this. Is this the craziest thing ever? What is wrong with the sugar cane? I don't get it. I do not understand this. All I want is for one of them to grow one time. Just one little, and I'll feel better. I got to stick around? You mean, because do you think I'm going far away enough to where the chunk's unloading? That's probably a good, that's probably a good point. I'm probably going away far enough to where the chunk's unloading, huh? Darn it. That's probably most definitely what's happening. Okay. Okay, let's go back in. We're going back down now. Okay. You know what we got to do? Unloads. <laughs> Frill uploaded his what? Oh, is that is that his is that his animated emote there? <laughs> That's cool. Here we go. We're going back down now. We got the wool in hand. I should really have this at the ready. Ooh, scared me. <laughs> Roger Key with that tier one sub. Thank you so much. Get them the tier one sub over to Sir Ripoff. Amazing. Thank you very much for that. <laughs> it actually startled me. Okay. Just walking around an ancient city in hardcore. No big deal. Uh, okay. Okay, these wooden structures here, they usually have chests. I don't know why I'm on the struggle bus to find chests. I need an adult. Oh, there's a chest right there. Okay. Whew. Let's go over there. This is why you want lots of wool, dude. Ooh. Ooh. That could be risky, dude. All right, we're going this way. If I fall, it's like, it's just game over. I can't. No. I didn't like that. Okay. I don't want to go down there. I thought there was a chest a lot closer than this. Oh. I must have bumped my head or something. Look at these shriekers just wanting to tell on me. Oh, the shrieker right below us. Oh, man. You could see a chest from the opening up top. I mean. Over here, maybe? Oh, my gosh. This sucks. Oh. Okay. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Okay. I got a bunch of stupid stuff. This is not what I want. Ooh, a little disc fragment, dude. What's what I got to do? Glowberries. Two disc fragments. Ooh. I didn't wrap it good enough. It's hard to wrap it when it's still stupid. Like up against walls and stuff. Totally got lucky there. I know. 
I'm gonna run out of stuff here. <laughs> this is a long run back. I'm never gonna make it if he comes out. Oh! <laughs> Brassy Chassis with 100 bits. Thank you so much for that. Hey, you skiz and chat. I'm lurking, doing busy stuff. Skiz, maybe plant sugar cane in two spots so they both get loaded. Oh, I see what you're saying. As you go back and forth. Oh, gotcha. Just a silly idea. No, that's smart. That's smart. Look at that. Skiz sneaking in the warden's stinky, dark, dwelling, tippy toes. Okay. I really want... Running out of wool here. Okay. All right. I was able to open it. <sighs> this sucks. It's giving me a bunch of stupid stuff. I want real stuff, man. Do these stack? No. These chests are disappointing. There's another one over there, though. Whoop. Up. Ooh. Well, I don't care. I mean, I'll grab it, but who cares about that? Is are these nice? Probably not. All right, we're not finding the good stuff, but we are being brave and awesome. Get back now. We want plenty of wool. I'm just running in here. Look, all reckless. So nerve-wracking, dude. Look at this. Look how much ground we covered. I wanted to get Swift Sneak. All right. Woo-hoo-hoo! Oh, my gosh. That is some nerve-wracking stuff, dude. This is... You know what I'm happy about? This really, like, revamped Hardcore. This is the maddest thing I've ever seen anyone do in hardcore. This is like completely revamped it. You know what I mean? Because we had a good world, but it was like, you know, all I got to do is tread lightly. I'm going to be fine. But now I've like moved and now we're just tiptoeing in the ancient city. And and eventually I'm going to wake him up on purpose and trap him is what I'm going for. <laughs> Shadow Thief, I can breathe. Oh, it's amazing. Now we are bringing the stream to an end here, uh, but I'm super pumped, man. Like this is hardcore is, you know, it's back. I, I even, I was getting worried. Like, am I going to go back to that world? I have so much else going on or whatever, but we're back now. Hold on. Let's get safe before you start bragging skiz. I know I'm going to come out of there one time and a creeper is going to land on my head and I'll be just, that's it. <laughs> hardcore is now hardcore. <laughs> How's work? What a nice thing to ask. Work works. Work's been okay. It's honestly, it's getting a little bit better. You know, it's getting a little bit better and like, you know, don't get me wrong. I don't want to complain about work. I'm, I'm blessed for the people that I get to work with and everything. I really am. But that, that big old thing I was telling you about, like with work, whew, that big old thing here, we'll do this. I'm going to, I'm going to, oh, let me see what day we're on. Day 370 people. We're on day 370. Amazing. Always just lurk with that prime sub. Thank you very much. You're outstanding. Thank you. Uh, hardcore. What did I say? Three, day 370? Yeah, so I finally was like, all right, I'm going to, I I made some changes and I, I I had to bring, I had to bring management into it. I'm like, oh, so here's the deal and blah, 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 and blah, and here's our options, left or right. And uh, they were awesome. They're like, you're doing a lot of stuff right, man. People are, are raving about you. They, they like you and all this stuff. And then they're like, you got to come to us earlier than this. <laughs> it's like high level management. 
I'm like, I know, I don't like to bother my managers. They're like, yeah, we know that. We know that about you. You try to take everything on yourself. They're like, you don't need to do that. <laughs> but, uh, but you know, it's 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 going in the right direction. I'll say that. That the impossible thing is starting to become much more probable, which is good. Lady Birdie Bop with a thousand bits. Goodness gracious. Thank you, Lady Birdie Bop. You're amazing. Thank you. Oh, the video of my son. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. Okay, Lady Birdie Bop, thank you. I want to show you this. So my son and I, I need to get my fitness in check. That's that's for certain. But um uh do you know so there's we used to do a lot of CrossFit stuff when we were younger and and I in there was, you know, you do a lot of jump roping in it, like a lot of gymnastic stuff, but jump roping is one of them. And there's a there's jump roping called double unders where the rope goes under your feet twice per jump, right? And uh and we both got pretty good at it and and he has been working on his triple unders. I've never gotten a single triple under, so we're so we're clear. He's been working on his triple unders. Let me see if I can show you this. It's in slow motion. It's gonna be the we're gonna get that that ring of light. Watch this. Look at that. Those are triples. <laughs> Isn't that crazy, dude? Like consecutive triple unders. That is a very, very big deal. Blown away how high he's jumping. It's nuts, right? Otherwise known as the hup. <laughs> yeah, it's yeah, his so the thing about double unders, well so like I've always had this goal. I've always wanted to hit a hundred double unders in a row, like unbroken. And I've never met, I think my record is 97 and I think I've hit it twice. Oh, I've never gotten to a hundred. But the thing about it is that something weird about double unders is that, and I can't even imagine what it must be like for triple unders, but something about double unders when you're doing them and you're like, just going, when you're at 40, 50, you just feel like you're just in the zone. But the second you trip up, like in that very moment, it's, you can't breathe. Like it blows your mind how exhausted you are in that moment, right? That's why he hit the ground because he just did almost 10 triple unders in a row, which is just crazy. Derp's over here with the 100 bits in honor of Skiz Jr. Also, have you said plur to him yet? I'm so curious if he knows that popular rave. Oh, that's right. I was supposed to do that plur. Okay, I'm going to do it tonight. I'm going to do it actually probably right after this. In fact, let me see something. I wonder if he's home. He's probably not. He's probably working. Yeah, he's working. I was going to say, I tell him to come in here. Uh, I'm going to do that, but I'm going to tell him plur. We're going to do that. <laughs> yeah, he's uh, he's pretty nuts, man. Pretty nuts. All right, uh, who who we want to raid? Hmm? Who, who we want to raid today? I'm looking, I'm looking around. We love raiding people. You know, we love doing that. It's one of my favorite things about this. Uh, look at that Callum with the host coming in. Welcome Raiders. We're actually ending, but we're about to raid somebody. And so we're trying to figure out who we want to raid. You know what I mean? And, uh, I'm thinking, I'm looking not a whole lot of people on right now. Let me see. I'm looking at. I'm going to, so is that a friend of yours? Derps? Oh, wait, hold on, wait, Link, Link Z, who's that? <laughs> Skiz the stream and raid myself. All right, goodbye, everybody. Welcome, Raiders. All right, Ace, take care. Actually, I don't know, you guys ever watch that uh, Search of Random? That's not a bad idea. I, I do like to raid, like, like, I like to raid smaller Raiders sometimes. You know what I mean? But then there's Kalina. That's that's a bunny. That's either your friend or, or coffee's friend. I can't remember. We're gonna raid Kalina playing Stardew Valley. We're gonna get that loaded. Um, I've raided Kalina before. She's a sweetheart. Uh, we're gonna get that going and send you on over there playing something called Stardew Valley. Even if you don't stick around, make sure you uh, Spec is your friend. I didn't see Spec. No, well, was that who I raided yesterday? That's who I raided yesterday. Yeah, yeah. But I don't see him. Is he raiding? Is he 
Did is it, I already started it. Is he streaming? Because I don't see him. Oh, I may have not clicked. Oh, he's not. Okay. Uh, all right, I'm going to send you over to Kalina, who's doing some Stardew Valley. Hopefully, I see you tomorrow. If I don't, you know how my life is crazy. You guys are amazing. Be good. Be good to each other. Thank you so much for everything. Thank you very much for all the awesomeness. I'll talk to you guys soon. Thank you, guys.